Okay, so we're gonna go into an interval of 30 seconds, high intensity, another 30 seconds, high intensity, and then 30 seconds, restore. Bring it on down. And we're gonna take a couple exercises and we're gonna go through them for sure two times. Who knows, I might even take it three. So let me show you the modification of the first exercise. Come to the back of your mat. Alternate lunges with me. Alternate lunges. <clears throat> okay, so this is low impact. You can stay here if you'd like. I want you to step forward enough that your knee does not come over your toes. All right, so that's exercise one. High intensity looks like this, upright mountain climbers. Okay, I'll talk you through that, but most of you guys know what that is. And then for the second set, because we're gonna move right into it, you guys, I want you to run and kick your butt. Okay, so we're igniting the hamstrings, we're hamstring curling it. So low impact can just be creating a little run, lifting the heels, okay, because I want you to ignite those hamstrings and turn them on. Any questions? Ah. Yeah, what do you love about your life? What lights you up? What people is it that you just surrounding yourselves with them, just like, oh, I just feel good. I feel energized. To come back to this question, you guys, when you're feeling down, when you feel challenged, it will ignite you. Upright mountain climbers or forward lunges, go. I'm coming over to Olivia. Because <laughs> you had on little jeans, right? I know. Yeah. yeah. What is that one? Is that, I, wonder, I think Kylie would love that movie. She loves musicals. This is like a PG movie, right? Yeah. Come on, girl, get higher than me. Yes, explode, yes. Good, and run, go for it. Keep the heart buoyant, keep those collarbones wide. I want you to pretend like that floor is on fire. So find a fast twitch through the legs. Feel those hamstrings turning on. Almost there. Okay, good, now bring it on down. Keep the heart buoyant, keep the capacity of the lungs open. 30 seconds, we're gonna rest. And then we're gonna come back to lunges or upright mountain climbers. Let your breath make it all the way down into your belly. What lights you up? What people have you been admiring from a distance? Go. Come on, explode through those legs, you guys. Whatever exercise you're in, I don't care. I just care that you've got it turned on. So if you're lunging, push off the floor and hug the muscles of the legs into the bone. Come on. Keep the heart buoyant. Pray that the trade wings come back. <laughs> and if it feels better to stay on your mat, you could turn that way, you guys. If you feel like your feet are Awesome. Come on, bring it, bring it, bring it. Yes, there it is, Lori. Come on, girl. There it is. Yes. Okay. We're gonna do one more round of that. Come on, I want you to know what it feels like to really bring forth the fullest brightness inside of you in this last 15 seconds here. Keep a good amount of space between your hips and your ribs. 
Good, and run it out. Shoulders relax. Kick that booty. Literally kicking that booty. <laughs> Picture your breath moving into your body like light. Making the lungs glow. Torso, buoyant. Almost there. A little faster, fast, fast. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Option one, jumping jack. If you don't want impact on the feet at all, do jumping jack only with your arms, okay? So that's low intensity. Are we clear there with that option? Mm -hmm. High intensity, jack, tuck. Okay, 30 seconds. The next 30 seconds is a wide angle push up, okay? Either jumping jack or jumping jack tuck, go. Because I believe there is a potential inside of you, yeah, mama, that you've yet to break into. <laughs> and I do believe that you light up people's lives. People's lives that you don't even know who they are and they're admiring you from a distance. By the things you say, by the way that you be. Push-ups, wide. Hands wide. You can stay on your knees, but the hands are wide. Keep a head in alignment with the neck. Beautiful, Lori. Now as you straighten the arms, isometrically pull the arms towards each other. Yes. Hands a little wider, Jess. Yep. a girl, amazing. Okay, 20 seconds rest. No, 30 seconds. There's this woman that works at my daughter's school and she helps the kids out of the car every morning. Parents drive up to the school so the kids can just exit. And she's so calm, always smiling, super bright woman. Like just you drive by her and I'm thinking, what does this woman practice? Who is she? Like what does she do that she is just this brilliant in her being? Super sweet, calm, steady, greeting greeting us every single morning. Yeah, yeah. Woo! Leanna's in the house. We're getting that limp moving, you guys. This is the tonic to your whole being. Wide push-up. And I admire this woman's energy every time. I drive into school. And I said to my daughter one morning, God, isn't she so beautiful? Isn't that woman just amazing? And she said, Mommy, why don't you tell her? Isn't that sweet? And I walked by her one day on campus. And I just stopped her, hey, who are you? Do you have a child that goes here? Or, you know? Who are you? And she told me she works there where she works with the special needs children. And I was like, wow, of course you do. They are so blessed to have you. I can just tell by driving by you that you're gifted at what you do. And I just want to tell you that I think you're beautiful. And, and it, was just, it was just sweet. Go, here we go. You guys, I was totally energized by just expressing to her the way she inspires me or to express to her what I see in her. Yep, keep your jaw and shoulders relaxed. We're almost there. Wide push-ups. Laura, you would never have been able to pull that off a few months ago. 
You know that, right? Yep. That's huge, girl. That's huge. You definitely wouldn't be able to pull it off with a smile you pull it off with now. That's for certain, girl. So amazing. One more second. Go, go. Okay. One more round of this. I know we can do it. So I'm going to challenge you with one more thing. So the first challenge is, what do you love about your life? And to ask a few people this. Maybe even strategically putting it somewhere at a gathering where maybe the energy is just kind of getting, oh, why'd that person say that or whatever, right? Just experiment with, oh, I wonder how, what kind of energy shift I can orchestrate with a simple question for somebody. The other is to let somebody know that you do admire them. Who is it that lights you up? That just makes you feel good just being around them. Just driving by them. Here we go. When you come to straight arms, make sure you're not hyperextending the elbows. Good, Leanda. Yes, Jess. Keep grounding through the inner edges of the hands, Jess. We're almost there, you guys. I know you got light in there to extract out. Come on, let it out, let it out. <laughs> Woo! Bada bing. Go ahead and hydrate yourself. 